You know, the violence in Hampton and elsewhere in Hampton Roads, as we're seeing, was a focus of tonight's Mayor's Forum. And for the second time this year, mayors from all seven cities got together to talk about public safety. It was a Facebook Live event hosted by Hampton Mayor Donnie Tuck. Ten of your sides, Gina Arevalo, tuned in and joins us live. Gina? Yeah, Tom and Anita, the big message tonight was unity in the community. The mayors are working with a nonprofit called Cities United to revamp their approach to public safety with the end goal of making Hampton Roads a safer, healthier, and hopeful community for everyone. Now, the mayors representing the 757 are taking back their communities. And they say this cannot be the norm, so they are working with this nonprofit whose mission is reducing homicides and shootings by half, particularly among young black men and boys. Together, they're developing a comprehensive plan to combat community violence, and this includes addressing the violence as a public health crisis, partnering with schools to boost student outcomes, setting aside funding for these efforts, and creating jobs and expanding transportation across the region. We cannot have economic growth where violence prevails. People, businesses are not going to go to communities where it's not safe. People are not going to settle in, in places that are not safe. And yet we cannot eradicate violence without economic opportunities. Now, city leaders say they are also partnering with faith-based ministries and with local employers. The city of Newport News says it's partnered with the shipyard to train some candidates and offer a guaranteed starting salary. And something else that city leaders say is needed is more compassion and kindness. Newport News Mayor uh, McKinley Price shared a story. He said he spoke with a teen who had gotten into some trouble, and he asked that teen, what could the community have done to prevent you from going down that path? And that teen said that nobody had ever told them that he was loved. And so, again, they're just saying to offer more compassion and kindness to each other. That's something that everybody can do. Live with the latest, Gina Arevalo, 10 on your side.